hello and welcome to my youtube channel in this video you will learn that how to add different kind of animated and graphic models libraries to the proteus so here you can see the library folder you can download this library folder from the link provided in the description so open it and here you can see the library folder open this and from here copy the library file from here go to the desktop and here you can see the proteus icon right click on it and from here go to open file location now go one step back to the main folder of proteus 7 now locate the library folder here here you can see open it and paste the file over here so here you can see the models are added here close it now open the proteus software if you have already opened it close it and reopen it again otherwise it will not show the latest libraries so after reopening you will be able to see the latest libraries as well so open it And now here so here search for the models and here you can see the multiple models let me explain one by one so here you can see the 12 volt battery library then here you can see the 9 volt cell here you can see the bulb here you can see the capacitors here you can see the cell here you can see the LED which is blue green LED and now R LED so here you can see different kind of LEDs here you can see the potentiometer here you can see the AC power supply which is a AC power supply generator here you can see the second one generator here you can see the push button here you can see the resistor here you can see the switch and this is also switch so let me select all these double click on it then double click on this double click double click double click when you press double click so here you can see the libraries are added here let me click on this one so please keep in mind that this is the AC power supply and this is the DC power supply so put button you can see here added now resistor switch 1 and switch 2 click on ok now pick one by one let me pick the LED here green and then red now pick the power switch now pick the battery connect the power over here and ground with this let me run it so here you can see whenever I press the switch so here you can see the red green and blue and same here you can see the generator so let me place it here and uh, here let me check the second switch here you can see the bulb let me connect the positive with this then connect it here now like this now let me run it and let me power on the switch so here you can see the bulb are turned on click on this edit properties and from here you can set the voltage frequency etc here you can see bulb are turned on let me turn off turn on turn off and uh, in this we can check the DC source as well the push button as well let me check the push button and DC source as well place it here now let me pick the green LED the push button and now make the connection like this now let me run it and let me press the icon sorry I have connected the wrong pins delete it and rotate it like this please keep in mind that in DC source you will have to note that the positive and negative are connected correctly let me run it and press it sorry sorry 
let me check its voltage click on edit properties and here you can see 24 volt instead of 12 volt let me change this to 12 or 5 volt let me change it to 5 volt because we have connected it in already so now run it again and now here you can see how push button works So this was the method of how to add different kind of models in a Proteus. The library files are available in the link provided in the description. You can download from there. If you like the video, please subscribe my channel, like and share the video. Visit my channel for more videos related to it. Thanks for watching.